Here's our evolution of travel beds that we've used from baby all the way to toddler years. When our babies are young, we like to use a portable bassinet that's very travel friendly. We use this first before a travel crib because it's much easier to pack with us and it potentially can save us check baggage at the airport. After our babies grow out of a bassinet, then we move them to a travel friendly crib. I've got a blog post about the travel cribs that I recommend and what I specifically look for. I really like using the slumber pod with our travel crib because it gives them a blackout space and a little bit of freedom and flexibility for me in the hotel room. Now my toddler used a travel crib until the age of two and then we knew we needed to transition. The next thing that we transitioned to was an inflatable toddler bed that we still are currently using. We've tested out a few of them and I've also got a blog post about the best inflatable toddler beds. Just like the travel cribs, we also pair our inflatable toddler mattress with the slumber pod. The inflatable mattresses do fit with the slumber pod, they just push against the sides a little bit more. Now a tip when it comes to travel beds is make sure you practice with them before your vacation. About a week or two before, I'll start practicing naps in them and also do an overnight sleep before we leave. Be sure to check out the caption for more info 